Hello everybody, welcome to game number X for Tentalica. Literally no idea. I literally don't have any idea of the record of this team. It's got some amount of wins, 17 wins. Need about seven more to tie with top place, so eight more to be top it's eight in a row as well because I've already got loads of losses. Effectively, this is like 120 lost five, um, which is obviously nothing to write home about. Um, the team is starting to look decent. Went with Mighty Blow on that Nurgle Warrior to, in an effort to get Claw before the finals, if that is to happen. Um, let's have a look at this guy. First of all, his record. So Wizard could be possible. Um, he's got an Agility 4. He's got 12 players. He's got a Blodge White. He's got 3 Dodge. Four bludge and a dodge. Actually, four strength five fleshy. Um, he doesn't have 150, so he can't buy a wizard. I don't really want to use a wizard in this match. 10 3 3 isn't that good. But then I guess my record doesn't look that good either. Um. Yeah, I think I'll just buy a babe, as as was mentioned, buy a babe, because you're probably going to get 50k. And, um... I don't, I don't want to spunk my whole bank on it. Like, he can get, sure, he hasn't got Mighty Blow with the Claw. He can do some bullshit, but I've got Claw Might. I've got Claw Might, Claw Pom to get all these guys. So, um... Yeah, I don't think it's scary for the TV. TBH. Yep, thank you, Viking of Mars. Yep, yep, right. Tschüss, everybody. Enjoy the match. I'm tryharding, so there you go.
die, insert. This seems like a dumb foul, right? But the thing is, I think if I remove him and don't get sent off, which, okay, I did get sent off, I could have um, got my guard in the... move my guard through there to protect the uh, claw. That was the thing. Unbelievable, didn't die from the mic, but he missed the dodge, oh yeah, he is a jumping forward dodge for him. Really sucks that I don't have the um, dirty player for the, to foul the dogs now, but never mind. I'm a seven. I just 
doesn't matter because I've got caught up anyway. But obviously I'm going to make that GFI all day. Yes, thank you. I would like to blitz that werewolf. <laughs>
random ass move punished, but not fully, unfortunately. Yeah, VIP go VIP Kurgle. It's not it's not a great record, but um it's so good just actually having block on everybody now. Is um, is unbelievable. Um I think it's it's twenty five games, so yeah it's seventeen six two. Um But Yeah, I don't know, it's um I just my my disturbing presence never works ever. It's pretty funny, but um, yeah, it's so good just being able to make two dice blocks with block every time instead of just not being able to do that. Um, I'm reading chat just because I did. I clicked over to it, and it's not my turn, so it's not so bad to read it. Oh man, look at that! What a piece of shit! What an absolute fucking piece of shit! And really, I wanted this to be the guard instead of this one. If it had been the guard, that would have just been a one die. So, <sighs> yeah, it's funny. The only loss that I've had since I've been tryharding was the one against the um, dwarves that made twelve AV breaks into eight cars and three KOs, which was pretty unlucky, I think. And my wizard failed, and I double wand to stop the guy hitting my ball carrier and stuff. So, I think I was pretty unlucky that game that I lost. So, there you go. It is what it is. Right, try this. My e blow, my e blow paying off. Yes, excellent. Fucking hell, this guy in his regen, for fuck's sake. Doesn't doesn't regen the skillless zombie, but regens is bludge werewolf and block fleshy. God damn it.
Time for his unassisted foul, probably, isn't it? That's what I imagine is going to happen. Into death, no doubt. I just, I just wanted a greed reroll in just to teach him a good lesson about being fucking stupid and giving me that block. <laughs> I mean, that was that was awful play by him, wasn't it? Giving me a mighty blow hit, not using stand after I specifically moved him there so that, like, if I moved him here, fair enough because then just be taking a one dice. But the fact that I specifically move in a way that if he doesn't use stand firm, I get another hit, and he doesn't use stand firm and gets an extra hit, he might take the skull in to concede here. No, he's got no choice but to take the skull. Is that a GFI? I guess I'll take the GFI if I have to. Three down, actually. Maybe I can make it three days. Mm, seven is not Sweet. Sweet as a geesh. Shit that he's got 12 players, he's gonna have a full 11 for the second half, probably. These two regens, absolutely massive. Yeah, I can't even foul. Well, I'll move as I can. I've got, I've got two reserves, he's gonna get core hits though. He has to come back for me, doesn't he? So I guess. I'll make a big foul on, the, on him would be pretty good. But I have to do it this turn, which means it couldn't be that big.
good. I don't want double GFI. One GFI is okay for the extra assist, isn't it? <laughs> you mark him. Just kidding. No regen, I mean, if I get the cards, it's good, isn't it? No, yeah, that's good for consent. Oh. So now I really need no no KOs or anything. Oh, shit. I mean, hopefully, one of those, one of these three will stay out, at least. Um, and hopefully he'll come back. I did get the babe though, didn't I? So eight times out of nine, he's back. So I guess on that on that basis, I should have thought of that when I decided to foul. He is back eight times out of nine. Yeah, of course he fails. All right. That's okay. I really need him to come back though. Holy shit. Three, four, five, six, seven. He's got eight. And he's potentially got eleven. I guess I've got ten, potentially eleven. But you know, if you make some cas here, he's got mighty blow, he's got claw, he's got three dice. Might be better to spread them. Still got most of his playmakers, only two playmakers out. Be great if they both fail, wouldn't it? Holy shit, if these both fail, that'd be really nice. But survived, survived the LOS, so the foul becomes good now, doesn't it? Just need him to come back. Yes. And now the big one. Z oh, yes. Glorious. RNG. Nuffle on my side. Beautiful. The only bad thing is they've got so many fucking skills. 
it's hard to um, work out who to put where. I think it's better to save my guard players than the mighty blow one because the mighty blow one is a project player. The guard players are complete. So it's not such a big deal, is it? The frenzy can go either side. Mm, I don't know, actually. Because then the frenzy's got to block that side and if I tackle from there. At least they're safe from me, killer. Yeah, that's true. That's true, but really, you want to win the game, don't you? So you got you got a cast, that's okay. Hopefully you can get a touchdown then in the second half if um if all goes well. There's a chance. Put three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's still got ten. Has he? Three, six, seven, eight, nine. He's got nine. Yeah, ten and twelve. He had one reserve. Nine. Nine versus eleven. But he had, he does a mighty bone claw. And three dice, so it could change. Right. Ridiculous, isn't it? Random blocks. Random blocks. You know, you put all this thing, you put all these skills, 108 star player points, in the claw, mighty blow, piling on tackle, and then just random blocks get get removals. And now it's 9 versus 9. Outrageous. Maybe even 8 versus 9 after this. Natural mighty blow hit. No. Crazy, isn't it? Absolutely crazy. He's learnt that maybe he doesn't want his wolf hit by Corpom. Oh, 
Oh man, get banged on. Didn't even need the claw mighty blow there. I went with him because I didn't realise it was a GFI first of all. And also because I didn't want to do it with him, you know. I wanted to um I wanted to focus on having him free to take down the wolf. I guess I could have just gone one, two, three, four, five, and then come back to six. And he could have gone in there like I wanted anyway. I was muted then, I was talking and I was muted. Um, two casts from him in his first game in the Mighty Blow is pretty good, isn't it? And if you get, if I somehow get a touchdown on him, um, he's only he's only four casts away from levelling up again into Claw, which would obviously be great. Dirty dog with a foul. He's exposed his wolf though. Happy days. Happy days. Hopefully get the killing. Well holy shit now he's exposed his ball. <laughs> he's changed his mind. The frenzy could have got him, couldn't it? Ooh. I'd love I'd love foul appearance to work one time. What it's worked one time in about eight or nine games now over the last couple of days. Bang down, I guess I should have got my guard in there to stop that.
Bang on. Absolutely fucking bang on. Holy shit. Pretty huge that, isn't it? <laughs> Four players removed this drive. Unfucking believable. Unbelievable, really. He's removed four players with, like, hardly anything. Good job I've done all this first to make it even a fucking game. Unbelievable. Unfucking believable. The look he's had this out. Make a pointless GFI. It's a good, good idea to let me back into it. Thank you very much. Cheers, buddy. What a game to not win. Can't believe it. But that's that's the weakness of, of bash teams, isn't it? Some removals and there's not what you can do. Luckily he makes these pointless GFIs. <laughs> Continuously.
Oh man, that's kind of tempting to go for the surf, isn't it? And then he's there to recover. Because right now, even if he does the two GFIs to hit him, I can't even follow up. I'm just not even. I've got to do it, though, haven't I? Go for the pal. Best, simply the best if I go. All the one. There's the game. No, I, mean, I guess actually, there was enough time left that I guess I didn't have to go for this. Pretty much had to go for it though, no fucking players on the pitch. Which obviously is how all of my opponents have found themselves in, in the previous games that I played today and yesterday. But, that's claw bomb for you, isn't it? He's just done it with randomness. Yeah, the mighty blow guys making plays. I guess it's better to fail the dodge here than to um, fail the one dice. But then obviously to roll it because the th if I roll a four plus, it's I'm still got to make a dodge. So I guess it's better to dodge. It's so shit that I can't even put tackles on the ball. I'll get surfed. Cause even if I run around, he's, I guess it's not too easy for me actually if I run around. I'm trying to make a GFI. Why not? Why not, buddy? <laughs> Why not? Good job these KOs stayed out, those two KOs stayed out, because what a fucking joke this half has been. Five removals. And one dice, really. Oh my god, why don't you just fucking double skull, you piece of shit? Unfucking believable, as if he went for that. <laughs> Good job I got babes. I just it's a shame I've used so many rerolls I guess. But show sure hands for the pickup and some turns left to score might not be too bad. Babes babes and make one KO roll. Standard. Seems pretty fucking standard to me. One one two. No fucking players. So that foul looks really terrible now, doesn't it? Six players off the pit, for fuck's sake. Four, five, six, seven players. Three, six, versus nine. What the fuck? Blood ball, man. Fucking blood ball. Stop fucking firing everything! Ah!
Wow, this is pretty unlucky. <laughs> pretty unlucky that he gets the perfect defense when I put him on the line to retreat after I blitz the fucking goal. Unbelievable. He's removed from these no hits now. Just awful, that perfect defense. Fill three out of four three pluses. <laughs> and then perfect defense. Oh, man.
I wish I wish Best Fagos had dodge. <laughs> Woohoo! Finally a foul appearance! Unbelievable, Jeff. Fucking hell, I don't know if I'm, when, I, when I'm muted and when I'm not. And it's pretty annoying. Oh god, that's he chain, chains the wolf away. Fuck. That was a really bad one. Maybe I should have pushed him to here. Or something. I didn't really know where to push him to. I should have thought for more than a second. If I get the both down, then he's got to dodge one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But it's whether he gets the fucking wolf into play and now or the ghoul, isn't it? He does have dodge. Of course. One dicer. Ah, unbelievable, Jeff. Now he's got frenzy. Ah, he failed his GFI. Brilliant. <laughs> oh, wow. That is glorious. I can't make it three dice, I don't think. Um, maybe I could. With a two dice, I can make it a three dice. That probably is worth it. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know, I'd have to get rid of this guy as well. I think it's worth making these two dices. Or is it? Because a one in nine means it's really bad. This is the sort of thing that I don't know what to do, you know? Because I think if I block this guy with him... And block this guy with him, then he can go one, two, three. I oh, can't even. Oh, yeah, four. He can go first. 
and he can go one, two, three, four, five, six. Then this would be three dice. Um, or he could just make the two dice, and it's it's not easy, is it? It's not easy to know which one's the right player. Just score. There's no just score in Prater Augustus. This is this is I'm trying to just score. But it's not necessarily the least rolls are better, because this is a 1 in 36 to fail, this is a 1 in 36 to fail. This is a 1 in 9 to have to dodge away still, see? Which is, you know, is it worth making three one in 30, two 1 in 36 fails to make this better? That's the sort of question you've got to ask. I think it is worth making two 1 in 36 fails. Then that's about a one, 2 in 36 chance of failing it, which I, I think it's worth it. That's what I'm going to do. Could I have made that a three dice for maybe actually? Oh, and now it's fucked. Now it's fucked. Didn't do that. Oh shit! So I should move these first. See, so talking to chat about it fucked me anyway. No, it doesn't because both down would have succeeded. Kurgol. See, I need both downs. So, so th that's the thing. I just needed both downs with these. This is this is one in nine. I've got to make a dodge. Which, you know, isn't great, is it? Okay, I didn't roll a 1 in 9. But, that's what I was trying to avoid. The 1 in 9 have to do the dodge. Both down here would have got... I was fucking stupid not moving these. Pissed myself off. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. He, sh he should move first, these guys, somehow, to get the assist there. So that, that was the idea. If the, these could be both downs, the only 1 in 36 failures to get these two out of the way. And he goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Then he blitzes on three dice. But, um, you know, that that was the thing. I really didn't want to... Um, why did I read chat? Because it was the last turn, because I was trying to do that on the last turn, but I shouldn't have done it. You know, it was the most crucial turn of the game, wasn't it? So if you're going to talk, that's when you've got to talk, um, isn't it, on those kind of things. That was a big thing, and I thought talking through might help me make the right decision. I think it was worth it, to be honest, making two 1 in 36s. Um, there, there was no just score play, was there? You know, if I could have just run it in, I would have done. But I think it was worth upping the one in nine or one in twenty-seven to, to have to make the dodge. But I don't know. It's one of those things. That it's it's interesting, isn't it? Thank you. Um, thank you very much, VIP Kirk. Um, yeah, it was crazy. That wasn't it. That was pretty fucking crazy that he had such a good chance, but it, just by random removals. Um, whereas mine were obviously you'd expect removals with. Claw mighty blow panning on. Um, he actually made all of his in the second half. I spread mine out over the whole game. So that second half was pretty brutal. Um, 15 out of 16 for that guy now. That's very nice, isn't it? Very nice. Um, and and that now, you see, this is why... Um, was it Kago Death said that I should spend 50k? Um, when I've got 100... 150. The thing is, now I don't have the money to replace uh, replace the rotter, do I? If I buy him and I've got 120, and I'm playing like say Ducky in the next game, I can't just flat out buy a wizard. So um, so there is that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that blitz was the game loser for him. Yeah, it was terrible. <laughs> no fucking way, Overlordy. I'm not. I'm not gonna buy a beast of Nurgle and. Um, you know, once you win a major on Fumble and, um, you know, play play 350 games on Fumble in Black Box with Nurgle and um, look at what Endzone does in Black Box with Nurgle, then um, then I will heed your advice. But right now, I think I know better. So, um, yeah. The babes were worth it. Yeah, exactly. Kick out failed, failed three out of four. I mean, they, they should have been worth it. They should have been worth it because... Um, because you know I had I had four three pluses and failed three of them, which was pretty unlucky. Whereas failing three out of four four pluses isn't outrageous at all, is it? Um, so there you go. Right. So I mean, this guy's great now, isn't he? If he gets a touchdown or a TD, he's all right. Um, he needs four touchdowns and a TD, or two touchdowns and th you know three touchdowns and a cas or something. Um, yeah, the MVP went the Warrior, but it, it got him to 15 rather than 16, unfortunately. I wasn't being that savage, Overlordy, but it was, you did it in all caps. You did it in all caps. And, um, 
Yeah, in in my YouTube guide, yeah, I say start with a beast because you lack so much power. But now I'm now I'm not lacking power, am I? Now I have I have a mighty blow guy. I've got some guard guys. I've got a claw palmer. I've got a strength four movement seven sure hands guy. I've got a frenzy guy. I really I've got a dirty player. I really don't need the um the power of a beast, you know. Whereas a thousand TV, it's the only fucking power you've got. Um. Thank you for the follows, Sergeant Wes seventy eight. Um, so yeah, I don't I don't know if they get the thirteenth guy or not. Sixteen thirty doesn't require thirteen players, so maybe it doesn't. I just really don't want to be men down, and I want to be able to use my I want to be able to use my dirty player. Um, I I won I won my major with the beast beast of Nurgle Mile. However, I got my team in a position to qualify for for the tournament without a beast and then I bought a rookie beast so um so what I would do is if I qualify for the champions ladder finals I might buy a beast you know um so it, it just depends yeah one conflicts milk somehow somehow one I got a bit salty through it though yeah I did get a bit salty but thanks for watching everyone if you enjoyed it don't don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic